Wave Studio Rack is a plugin that lets you save a chain of up to eight plugins as one setting. So, why is this good for you? You've always been able to save individual settings for each plugin, but invariably there's more than one plugin on a track. For example, on this track, which is a vocal, I have an EQ, a compressor, and a deesser. With Wave Studio Rack, I can take all three of those plugins and save them as one setting, with all of their individual settings saved as well. So, for example, in this lead vocal, where I have it spread over three tracks, all I need to do is duplicate it. One, two, three. Wave Studio Rack works with Wave's native plugins and some third-party plugins, and also with SoundGrid plugins in DSP mode. So when I get here to the professional studio, not only can he open up the session and have all those studio rack chains I created come up for him, but because he has a DigiGrid DLS, he can then process those with the onboard DSP, which frees up his computer for a lot of the things going on in the session, because it's a really good session, right? It's awful. No taste. And when you bring the session home again, all tracks with Studio Rack on them will recognize that you are no longer connected to a DigiGrid DLS or iOS and will revert back to native and work perfectly for you here as well.